Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, as you guys might have read from the title down below, we are going to be breaking out my clay beads and making some bracelets. Seriously, so excited to make some bracelets with you guys because I feel like since the launch of my new website, kellyprepsterstudio.com, we haven't had a bracelet making video in a while, so I'm so excited. Don't worry, I'm still going to be making tons of bracelets on my channel. I'm still going to be making pony bead bracelets. It's just going to be a little variety of everything, so I hope you guys have been loving all the videos lately. I hope you guys have been loving my new website also all the social media clips i'm really trying and it's really fun especially since this is my second youtube channel my main channel is just at kelly prepster where i share fashion and beauty so it's really fun because i feel like i have a whole new entity or a little space on the internet and i'm so happy that you guys are here so definitely hit that subscribe button down below so you can get notified when my next new video is i upload every sunday and then an occasional thursday video as well so definitely hit that subscribe button because you don't want to miss out on those random surprise videos so like I mentioned we are going to be making some clay bead bracelets today I am releasing a new launch on Friday April 14th 2023 so definitely set an alarm in case you guys want to shop the site I'm also going to be having a sale go on and I love doing the sales where the coupon automatically applies so if you guys are enjoying that or like that be sure to let me know in the comments down below but before we get started I do want to mention one thing I started my channel with focusing on the behind the scenes of my Etsy well I recently just put my Etsy on vacation mode because I really want to put all of my energy into my new website. So in case you guys have tried to find me on Etsy for the last week or so, it is on vacation mode. I don't know if I'll reopen that or not. I've just been having so much fun with my new site. Personally, if you guys are thinking about starting a small business, I highly recommend using Shopify. It is so much nicer. Yes, there is a once a month fee, but I feel like Etsy was taking like half of my profit. Since there's a listing fee, they take a percentage of your profit with every single item. So if you guys are thinking about that that's just my advice with that I'm not gonna chat anymore about that because I don't know if that's relatable or not but we're just gonna get started I'm gonna pull out all the supplies that you guys need in case you guys are new to making bracelets I also am definitely gonna be watching one tree hill we'll get into that so it's gonna be a quiet ASMR type video so I hope you guys enjoy it and let's just get started all right so you're gonna need some scissors I love using these little kid scissors I've had these forever but they're really helpful then of course my bead drawer so we are not gonna be making any pony bead bracelets bracelets today but I have them all in here and I do have a tray that my bracelets came with so this is from go create the pony beads it's just the lid to these containers and it's seven inches across and this is how I measure my bracelets and then along with that we are going to need some elastic I put my Kelly Prepster studio logo sticker on here and you guys isn't it the perfect fit this string is from the brand go create they sell it at Walmart it is by far my favorite elastic ever also these stickers are going to be launching on my Friday drop so be sure to keep an eye out for that i just have this huge stack of beads right there kind of embarrassed about it i'm working on a plan to make this more organized but these are all of my clay beads and i bought these on amazon and then i have some seed beads but we're going to be doing that in maybe a later date video and i'm also going to put on some hbo max and watch one tree hill just because i want to be extra quiet for you guys and i'm currently on episode 23 of season four i feel like i'm flying through it and then of course put some headphones on For the first bracelet, I'm going to be using these gold mini beads and some of these super cute flower beads. And all of these are from Amazon. I will try my best to have them linked in my Amazon storefront. But if I'm being really honest, I just kind of kept typing in clay beads and charms on Amazon until I found what I liked. But I realized I did not share this with you guys. So they're so cute. So we're going to make so many fun bracelets. Like in a lot of my videos, I like to lay out all the beads before I put them on the string. So I just took these super cute flower beads and put them in a little bit of a pattern. And I'm going to go by with this little gold bead and put one in in between each one of the beads. It's going to be so cute and I think it's going to be perfect for spring and summer.
Okay, you guys, so I'm definitely new to using clay beads, but I find when I do a pattern, it's super easy and helpful to kind of portion it out. I don't know the right words for it, like pluck them out and put them on the tray and then thread it because I get so confused. It's just a jumbled mess because mine are all by the color. So if I want to do any sort of rainbow pattern, it's like all of these have to be open and it just gets really chaotic. So you're going to see this go from this to a full bracelet. It's going to be so cute. And I love these little gold stars. Aren't these so fun? So we're going to thread this through this elastic.
Alright you guys, so these are the final bracelets. They are so cute. I love the combo of the clay and seed and the pearls. So these two are very similar, just different colors. And then I made this one so stinking cute. I love the little flowers. Again, I get very beachy tropical vibes, but also springtime. This one is so cute. It's like a little green happy face with the gold beads and then the flower rainbow bracelet beads. Oh my gosh. So these are so cute. They're going to be launching on Friday. There will be a discount code for you guys that's automatically applied when you shop that's going to go on for probably a week so be sure to check it out this weekend hey guys i just wanted to pop on because i have two orders to pack i'm so excited so wendy ordered this super cute pink think pink bracelet so we're going to pack it up on camera she was shopping on my etsy so thank you so much wendy we're going to write a handwritten note on this super cute little pink heart note card so i got my blue sharpie let's get writing all right so I wrote, Wendy, ah, thank you so much for shopping my Etsy. I hope you love it. P.S. I packed your order on my YouTube at Kelly Prepster Studio. Again, this is what her bracelet looks like. It's so cute. I love the different shades of pink, and we're going to put it in an organza bag. I just think this makes it so fun when you get it or if you're gifting it. And then we're going to put both of these into her mailing envelope. And then we gotta put her shipping label on. All right, fragile. And of course, a pink thank you sticker since she had such a fun pink order. Thank you so much, Wendy. I hope you love your new bracelet. I can't wait to see how you style it. Thank you again for shopping my Etsy. So we have one more order, and this is for my friend Michelle. She ordered two of my European charm bracelets. They're seriously so cute. So this one is called Dreamland. And you guys, it's got like a little unicorn and a flower and a little carriage, a crown and a star. I love the colors of this one. And then she also ordered my flower garden one, which each bead has a little bit of a floral print on the inside. I'm trying to get it in focus. Oh my gosh, so stinking cute. Thank you so much, Michelle, for ordering. We're gonna write a thank you card and put them in organza bags. Okay, so each one goes in a little organza bag. This one is so cute, I just love them. Perfect for spring and summer coming up. There we go. And a little heart card. Alright, so I wrote her name and I said, Michelle, thank you a million for shopping my new line of bracelets. I hope you love them. P.S. I packed your order on my YouTube at Kelly Prepster Studio. Cute hearts on the back. And we are going to put this in her bubble mailer. And also put her receipt in here. So when you order off my website, you get a receipt and then her bracelets. A green thank you sticker on the back of hers because it's so cute 
So thank you so much, Michelle, for shopping my new line at Kelly Prepster Studio. I hope you love your bracelets. I'd love to see how you style them. So feel free to shoot me a picture or a DM on Instagram or show me on TikTok. I'd love to chit chat with you and I hope you love everything you got. Thank you again for ordering. Again, if you guys place an order on kellyprepsterstudio.com or on my Etsy, I do pack every order on camera. So I hope you guys enjoyed this segment of today's video. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's bracelet making video. If you guys like clay beads, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up in case you guys want to see more bracelets like this. Let me know in the comments down below which bracelet was your favorite. Personally, I'm a sucker for this little flower one. I think this is so adorable and I can't wait to wear one similar like that so we can be twinning. Again, my website's always linked down below and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and I'll see you guys back here very soon with my next bracelet making video. Bye guys!